In this podcast we'll be looking at matrices using the TI Inspire. To begin we'll start up a new calculator screen by pressing the home button and one. And we should get that screen coming up. We will then press control and multiply to get this menu coming up and we'll scroll across until we have a two by two matrix and then we'll press enter. We'll be then be asked for the dimensions of the matrix we want to use and we will start with a 2 by 3 which is 2 rows by 3 column matrix we'll then populate it by just using the number pad and the navigation buttons and you'll find we can put whole numbers, negative numbers, decimals, fractions whatever we like into those cells we're then going to multiply this 2 by 3 matrix by another matrix and we need to make that a 3 by 2 matrix for the matrix multiplication to be valid. We then populate this second matrix which, which, with whichever values we like and then we can just press enter and we get the resultant matrix shown. With the CAS we can also define matrices so that's what we're going to do here. By pressing menu, actions, define we can define the letter A to represent a 2 by 2 matrix as shown. We populate the cells in that matrix. Now we can start operating with it. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to find the determinant of this matrix by going menu 8 2 and pressing enter and then we type in the letter A inside the brackets and close the bracket Next we're going to press enter and that will give us the determinant of the matrix we defined above. We can also transpose matrices using the same menu function. So we press menu, actions, come down to 8, matrix and vector. And then we're going to select transpose which will bring up a capital T to the right of the A. And then once we want to, we've entered that, we just press enter, and that will give us our matrix transposed. We can also define another matrix, say B, and we can define B to be another 2 by 2 matrix by pressing the menu button, uh, control multiply button, sorry, we populate that matrix and then we can start operating with it. So we'll be multiplying using the defined matrices. We can subtract, add, multiply by scalars, and we'll do all of those in the following screen grabs. So we've got our A and B defined. We can go A plus B, and the calculator automatically knows we're talking about those matrices. Press enter, and there you go. We could also go A subtract B. Press enter. And then we have the matrix A subtract B. We can go matrix multiplication by A times B. And that brings up the dot. We can also multiply by scalar. So just select the number 3 off the number pad times A. And then we have 3 times the matrix A. We can also multiply by a negative scale, such as negative 2. So we go negative 2 times B, and that's the resultant matrix we get. And then we can combine those two, so we can go 3A take 2B, and we get the following matrix E. Now, you may want to change that to A decimals, and we do that by pressing Control Enter. 